Hello everyone, today I have ZTE MF831 This is the LTE 150 Mbps I don't really understand about USB mode that run I never have problem with driver, just plug and play They have web user interface And compatible with router that have USB port and Raspberry Pi I have disassembly before and remove some seal They have auxiliary board that contains SIM card, NSD card slot, RGB LED indicator, some chip, and component, <coughs> and the last is likely synchronous converter. I don't know if I don't know if it bug or boost converter. Why this board have so many capacitor? Uh, this is capacitor, right? And this is the back of PCB, just ground plane with port. At the main PCB, we have built-in antenna, antenna connector, and antenna pin patch that I remove. And after removing the antenna patch, the signal is still good, maybe because they have the internal antenna. From the bottom side, we have Skywalk. Okay, focus. Skywalk. Sky77. 63.8 the signal amplifier the next is LTE chipset Qualcomm MDM 9225 this is the main component on this model we don't have much information about this chip and the last thing is Multi-chip package from Elite Semiconductor that contain NAN and DRAM. NAN size is 500 megabyte, and the DRAM size is 256 megabyte. Let's go to the top of PCB. At first, we have likely antenna splitter or anything about radio frequency that I don't really know about this. Next, we have transceiver from Qualcomm WTR160L and L4 LT, and the chip have Pregio wafer package, and they integrated with GPS. The last thing is Qualcomm power management. The last thing is Qualcomm power management IC PM8019. I think it's wafer level chip package. Not much information about this chip, but let's see the output voltage after inductor. Maybe we can see frequency and duty cycle. Let's test the voltage. I try to check the output voltage of this power management IC, but I can. I think this PCB built with several layer, maybe four or six. Hey, we have 5 volt in here. It's parallel. Yes. And in here, we have 3.4, 3.3, 3.4 volt. That's annoying. 